Why are you dressed like a game show host? Going out tonight. Just a minute, young man. You're still grounded. But it's for Mr. McIntosh. I don't care. McIntosh may have a pile of money, but he doesn't decide when my son is or isn't grounded. But it's for my job. Your job is to be grounded. Grounded. <laughs> so much for playing 442. What do you know about Plan 442? Well, it's the investment plan you've been working on. Your prospectus. Prospectus? What are you doing going through my work? Well, I didn't want to say what I told Mr. McIntosh about your Plan 442, and he was very, very interested. Yep, I promised him I'd bring a copy of it tonight and show it to him, but I didn't want to tell you just in case you got your hopes all up and... Uh... No, 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 of course not. Let me get you a fresh copy of the prospectus. No, I'll get a copy of it, sweetheart. Prospectus. Yeah. Here. Oh, thank you. Here. Hurry up. Go. Go. You want the car keys? Nah, that's okay, Dad. I don't drive yet. You want me to drive you? No, it's okay. You know, I still haven't met Macintosh. Maybe I should go over and meet No! Him. Why not? You ruin everything. He has a date tonight, and he's very nervous about it. I guess I can see him first thing in the morning. Oh, I don't know, Dad. I mean, no. Uh, I'd be up pretty late. This woman. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky dog. Later, toads.